It's your boy King Brando. What's up, Brando fam? I told y'all I was gonna start doing this where, like, after the shows, I would pick like a clip or something and I would watch it with y'all, react to it with y'all. So, right now, I got Daniel Bryan challenging uh, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn to a match at WrestleMania 34. Um, let's see what they got. That's what the video says. So, I'm interested to see because, like, uh, Dane Bryan, you can't fight both of them by yourself. You, you really can't. Uh, so let's see what he got to do. Hope y'all enjoyed the reaction video. Make sure y'all like the video and make sure that y'all subscribe right now. Like the video, subscribe right now. And I will be streaming uh, Fortnite and stuff on the PS4 like um, at 10 or 10 or 11. Uh, that's like Central Time, so that'll be like uh, 11 or 12 Eastern Time. And then, you know, Pacific time, y'all just, y'all, y'all gonna get the notification or whatever. Uh, make sure you like the video and subscribe. We'll be streaming later, but without further ado, let's get into this reaction video. Daniel Bryan challenging Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens, or Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, whatever, it don't matter. Cammy, call him what you want. Let's get it. Yeah. Let's see what Daniel Bryan finna do. I feel like he finna go savagery, savage mode on him. Uh, again, sorry for the bad camera angles. It's just, you know, that was the best that I can do. Shout out to Wrestling Mate. Go subscribe to them. You know, they, they pull out the clips. That's where we got the last one from, too, I think. But let's go. Let's see what they got. How you gonna fight both of them? He needs somebody else. And I don't think it's gonna be Shane. Cause Shane sits, and he got hernia. He's sick and got a hernia. I don't think it's gonna be Shane. Yeah. Uh, he probably gonna need a mystery partner or something. You know, last week was one of the greatest moments of my career. Salute to you. After so long. I finally got the news that I was waiting for. And it was that you're cleared. Clear. Oh, clap some more for him. Clap some more for him. Man. And I can now continue doing what I've loved to do for and over 16 up. years. Oh, clap some more for him. Oh, yeah, I'm clapping some more. And the support that I have gotten from all of you. You still got it. You still got it. Yeah, you're right. You still got it. Actually, really? Actually, I, I got all the chance wrong. I, I have a job to do. Oh, okay, okay. As we gonna shut up. Manager then. of SmackDown Live. Okay. We have said this a thousand times. SmackDown Live is the land of opportunities. And that it is. Therefore, I propose to give Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens one more opportunity. Dang, you give them another one? You just fired them. How you gonna give them an opportunity if they don't work for you no more? But just one. Mm, just one, though. No. See, you know you're doing your job right. When the whole crowd is chanting no. When they all chanting no, that's how you know you're doing your job right. Because they're supposed to be the bad guys. And everybody genuinely hates them other than me. I, I love them because they do their job and they do it right. Here is my proposal. What's the proposal? DB, Daniel Ryan, Brian Davidson. And Kevin Owens face Shane McMahon and Daniel Bryan. WrestleMania. I thought he was. I thought he had like the, the some some with a D. And I thought he had a hernia. How you gonna wrestle with a hernia? Huh? Huh? Now, due to complications from Sammy and Kevin's attack, Shane has been hospitalized. Right, he in the hospital. But How do you know that? Believe that he'll be ready to go. How? So, here are the stipulations. What's the stipulations? Tell us. If Shane and I win, 
Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens remain fired. Ooh, 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 ooh. I like that. Dang, but you're going to lose your first match back then? If That's a shame. If they lose and Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens win, they will be reinstated to SmackDown Live. Are you serious? Like I said, opportunities. Dang, you will lose your first match opportunities, back. Opportunities, opportunities. And I've had a lot of people ask me, why have you given Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens so many opportunities? Enlighten us, why, Daniel? I've given them opportunities because I think they are two of the greatest performers of this generation. Me too. I give them opportunities because I have known them for 15 years. Dang. I've given them opportunities. That's almost as long as I've been we've alive. Together. We've been poor together. Ooh. I've given them opportunities because when I needed a place to stay, they gave me a bed. So Kevin does have a heart. I gave them wow. opportunities because we fought together. Mm. I've also given them opportunities because that is my job as general manager. To give our amazing talent opportunities. opportunities. Okay. Opportunities. But I have a lot of jobs as general manager. Mm -hmm. A lot of things I'm supposed to do. Okay. I'm supposed to sit in board meetings. Yuck. For him. As a general manager, I'm supposed to fill out paperwork. Yuck. For him. Because, you know, a he's a wrestler. As manager, I'm supposed to wear blazers or cardigans or, or whatever this is that I'm wearing. <laughs> I don't even know what it is either. But do you know what? What, Dane? Tell us. I'm sick of meetings. Is he about to quit? And I am sick of paperwork. Is he going to quit and join the roster? I'm sick of wearing these blazers. Okay. Or whatever the hell that thing is. <laughs> oh my god, Dan, you're you funny. I thought you're hilarious. For three years Ooh. for my dream. For my dream to go back in there and compete. To go back in there and wrestle. And Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens tried to take that away from me. Mm. Well, I don't care how many times you kick me in the face. I don't care how many times you powerball me on the apron. You know that got hurt, Daniel is back, and Daniel Bryan will fight at WrestleMania. Just hearing him say it again, it's just like, I, I couldn't even believe what happened. I, I, I just like fanboyed out there a little bit. Even though he just told us before he was going to fight them at WrestleMania. Just hearing that again made me fanboy like it was my first time hearing it again. I'm sorry. Don't say I'm over-exaggerating, but the dude ain't wrestling in three years, bro. Three years, to avoid saying. As an underdog, mm. I really felt like I shouldn't say him. Um, as kids watching in the crowd, being a role model, right, right, I feel right. like I shouldn't say them. Right. As a general manager representing the SmackDown Live brand, it's things that I feel like I shouldn't say. Right, you shouldn't say. Okay. But he's going to say it, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing. Not Daniel Bryan, the underdog, and this is not Daniel Bryan, the general manager. Oh. This is the Daniel Bryan who fights for his dreams, and this is the Daniel Bryan who will not accept no for an answer, and this no. is the Daniel Bryan who will knock down any wall put in front of him, and this is the Daniel Bryan that's not just going to WrestleMania. This is the Daniel Bryan who's going to kick Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens at WrestleMania. I'm going to kick their ass. Oh. Oh. Ooh. He always says some powerful stuff. Some powerful stuff. 
But I think I forgot. That's the end of the video. But I forgot how good this dude promos was. The dude can talk. Like when I say dude can talk, the dude really can talk. It entertains me all the time. I really enjoyed this. Hope y'all enjoyed this. I know y'all enjoyed the la the ones from last week. This was lit, bro. We got matches. Well, a match. We got a match, bro. I don't I don't know how Shane's gonna wrestle. I don't know how how you gonna wrestle with a hernia and you got like diverticulitis, some some with a D. Uh, how? But it's supposed to be Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn versus Daniel freaking Bryan and Shane McMahon. Like, how do you? Uh, um, I'm, I'm stoked. Uh, hope y'all enjoyed this. It's been your boy King Brando. If you're returning to the channel, you should already know what to do. Like this video. Comment stuff you want me to do. React to. Review. Whatever. Whatever. Oh, yeah. Everybody. This go for everybody. Else. Tell your artists. Hit me up. Tell them to email me. Message me. Whatever on YouTube. Uh, email me. You know, I got the thing on there. So, do, do that, bro. I will work with you on getting your music on the channel. But, for the new people, the new people, you gotta do this thing called the three clicks. It's the easiest thing you're ever gonna do. Three clicks. Easy, 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 easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You just gotta do that. Then you can join the Brando fam. You wanna know why I call y'all fam? Cause you're not fans. Your family be closer than that. Let me get a hug, okay? But I'ma tell you what the three clicks is. You just gotta one, like this video. Two, hit that subscribe button. And three, hit them post notifications. Just do that, and you're gonna be in the Brando fam. And like, we just hit 1.4K, and I'm so stoked. I'm so stoked. We gonna keep growing and growing and growing. Like, it's just amazing, but it's being boy King Brando. Peace. Yeah.